Welcome back, WW Fly Corvair. Today we're introducing a new manual. This manual is the Pete and Pole Weight and Balance Manual. Most of our stuff is always applicable to Corvairs, but this particular item is for any Pete and Pole builder. It does cover installations of Corvairs, but also it covers Continentals, Fords, and has notes on Rotec and other uh, engines like Funks, various stuff. Uh, it's applicable to anybody building a peat and pole. It is a 60-page manual that is based on the data that we gathered at Broadhead on electronic scales. It's been an elaborate project over the years. It was presented in an abbreviated format in the newsletter many years ago, but is not available today. Uh, we have compiled all the information, added a lot of new stuff. Notes on cabanes and fuel systems are in here. A lot of data. If you're building a peat and pole, one of the things people always forget when looking at it is it may be a simple looking airplane on the outside, but a peat and pole uh, does have the world's uh, most complicated weight and balance issues for a home built aircraft. The reasons for this are not immediately obvious, but it is a significantly different aircraft and a lot of people make mistakes when assembling the airplane or just ignore the idea and think, I'm gonna move the wing when it's done. This is bad stuff. Results in a lot of people flying chronically tail heavy aircraft. Our whole mission here is to provide people with a good set of data that they can plan from, discuss the uh, ideas openly, and I include my cell phone number in the book so that people can contact me personally to develop their plan. Again, we do this as a service to prevent people from painting themselves into a corner or anybody getting hurt in their aircraft. So uh, a lot of friends worked on this with me. It's a really good project. Its introduction is going to be at Broadhead, the Pete and Pole Gathering, uh, this year, about 10 days from now. Uh, the proceeds from the sale at Broadhead will be donated directly to the guys at Broadhead who put the event together and the newsletter. After that, we'll have it available through our direct website. Uh, want to uh, just go give everybody the introduction and uh, this is what it will look like. Again, 60 pages, readily available uh, right after Oshkosh. Uh, I'll have plenty of copies with me at Oshkosh also right after Broadhead. So, uh, there it is. Uh, shout out to uh, uh, Dom in Canada. This copy's for you. I'm mailing it out tomorrow. Thanks for watching and please subscribe. <clears throat>